Yo guys, all you tight here and today we are back with another episode of Achievement Unlocked and today we are going to be playing Townscaper. Um, this is a game, I've not started this game yet, just for reference, you can see there, zero achievement. Um, <clears throat> and it's probably the easiest game to get achievements on, um, in the Xbox Game Pass. Um, I'm just going to get straight into it, so it's sort of like a, it's a relaxing game, I think is one of the ways to describe it. Basically you can just build houses as you please. Um, so we're just going to play that real quick. Um, set. I've already got one. Built a house with a spire on top. I've already got one. Um, you want to enable the grid, which just makes it far easier. Um, so that one I got there was for making a spire, which is literally just that. Just build a too high house. Um, and that gets you a spire. Um, I, I have a checklist of how to get them here, so bear with me. Next one I'm gonna do, next one I'm gonna do is build a hook. I wanna have a three long platform here. Build another layer up. Build one on top. Then remove. There you go. That is how you build a hook. Um, next one, you want to build a garden. Pretty sure this can be done on any sort of square. Um, the one I'm going to do here is a 3x3 three three square. Then you want to build all the way around, except leave the middle empty. You can see there, there's a garden in the middle. Very nice. And you want to do that again. Uh, this time, five by five. I think that's five. One, two, three, four, five. Yep. And then again, you want to build. No. Nope. All the way around. Make a circle. There you go, you've got a garden in the middle. Um, you want to actually build a second layer on top. Like so. And then you just want to remove one block from each of the walls. Preferably in the middle, that makes it a bit easier. And then you have a sculpture in the middle, which gets you that achievement. Um... Build a lighthouse. I just want to build a platform. Make a house. And then change the colour. Using down on the D pad, change the colour. Um, next one is a church door. This one's a bit strange. Oh, there you go. You, you can definitely zoom in. Uh, church door, you want to build a 3x3. Three three. Uh, if I remember correctly, you want to build sort of like an N... If you want to look down the bird's eye view, you want to build an N shape. It's like that, too high. And if you just place a block in the middle at the top, that builds a church door, apparently. If I just remove this. There you go, you can see that better. And uh, the next one is a bit complicated. Um... You want to find a perfect circle. It's a bit difficult to do in this game. Uh, so you want to sort of like go and explore. I reckon there could be one over here. Um, yeah, you want to find a circle. This one might take a bit of time because you sort of need to go exploring to find it, but. Um, would, 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 would this count? Don't think so. Um, it is a bit complicated. 
I'm not complicated, just, um... Yeah, there you go. Um, 100 blocks, is that one? Yeah, place 100 blocks. Uh, that is also one of the achievements, which you'll probably just get by doing this. Okay, I think that would count as a perfect circle here. I think that counts. What you want to do, you want to place a layer of houses and then remove all of the bottom bits. And that should put it onto pedals. Nope, that, that's not a perfect circle. Um, we were unsuccessful there. Um, is that one? Will this count as a perfect circle? It's just quite annoying because you have to like sort of explore until you do find one. Can you? Yeah, it's start a new one, new world. Um. Right, we'll do some others first. One of them is just building to the sky limit. Will also will help you to get to a uh, hundred or a thousand blocks if you haven't already. You, okay, you can't just hold it; you have to keep on pressing it. It is quite a satisfying game with all the noises it makes. And also, if you haven't got the spire one already, this will do it. I mean, yeah, put the spire on top every time. On. Gotta be close, surely. We'll put we'll put we'll put different covers on. We'll make it look nice. There we go. We've reached the <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, it gets slightly colourful all the way at the top. I just want to delete that real quick. Um, can we not delete that? Okay, sound. It's really, you know, you're not having to find this circle. Because you can't really get the perfect circle in this game, if that makes sense. Also, that um, that tower has kind of messed with the whole camera system. annoying to be fair. It's like I, I just want to get achievement, you know. There was a video I was watching. Does he perhaps use the like what what sort of shape does he use? Um, let me just have a look. Yeah, it was this video. Um, what shape does he use? 
Oh, no, he, yeah, his is fair enough. Yeah, no, I can see. Oh! Oh, is it? Um. Hmm. Really annoying, isn't it? Does it really have to be a perfect circle? It's quite annoying. Gotta just re keep on restarting until I find one. That surely that's one. Nope, that's still just a normal thing apparently. Um, yeah, I'm going to come back to you once I've found it. Alright guys, I finally found one. I think every map might, every time you start a new world, it might actually be the same. So it just does take a bit of looking. I was going down and right, I think. Um, but finally have it. I think. Quite complicated because... Where you place the houses is actually in the middle of the lines rather than in the squares. So I'm pretty sure this is it anyway because it's the same shape as the guy in the video. Bosh, there you go, propellers. And that is achievement number nine. So the last achievement is to place a thousand blocks. Fortunately, it doesn't track your progress. It just tells you whether you've got it or whether you've not got it. So I'm just going to speed the video up from here. And yeah, I'll see you guys once I place a thousand blocks. Alright guys, there we go, a thousand blocks have been placed, and that is that. We have all of the achievements on Townscaper. Is that the first game we've, that made, I think that's the first game we've actually got all the achievements for. Although I feel like I've said that before. Um, yeah, I just spam orange blocks, so see orange is my favourite colour. If I go achievement unlocked. Oh no, we got all of them in Superliminal, obviously. I forgot Superliminal was even the last one we did. And yeah, we didn't get to finish Life is Strange True Colours because it went off the game pass. Haven't finished Lancer Zombies yet. 
And um, I'm not going to finish Sally Face because you have to beat chapter all the chapter five without dying, and that just seems so tedious. But yeah, second game where we've got all the achievements. That is that for Townscape. If you guys did enjoy it, be sure to drop a comment and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.